<laughs> Do you know? Uh, well, I think if you look at, at Latin America in general, it's amazing while uh, the one silver lining that, that people in Latin America say is that the U.S. has been so busy in the Middle East that they haven't paid attention to us, which has led to a number of progressive governments coming into power in Latin America. And if you look at the case of Venezuela, it's a country that uh, used a lot of the oil money to spread out to the very poorest people in the country. And having been there myself, seeing some of the programs that have been funded with the oil money, it's people that never had a chance to get a high school education and now are having a chance to get a college education, people that never had a chance to get health care, getting health care, uh, all kinds of basic uh, services that people never had access to. Now that has meant that the elite in the country um, has been trying to turn things around and go back to the old days where they could take most of this oil money and enrich themselves. And so what you had is a media that was controlled by a small number of corporation, corporate entities uh, that were very much against the Chavez government and now the government of Maduro uh, that have been colluding with some of the wealthiest people in Venezuela to create a lot of shortages uh, of goods that would make the people turn against their government. Um, and there's a lot of NED and other U.S. money that have been going to foment opposition to the government. Uh, at some point, those things become a reality, and the government does start to crack down on freedom of the press because the press has been so uh, inciting uh, uh, um, a violent opposition. Uh, and you do get the shortages then that people are starting to protest against. Um, so I would say that this is a backlash against a progressive government and that um, we should recognize that the U.S. has had a hand in Venezuela from the time of the coup against Chavez and is rooting for the opposition to be able to um, do a, a coup against this government. Hmm. Hmm.